everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Broken Sword Shadow the Templars. Uh, I am Olaf and I am determined that we are... I'm determined to get my camera right first time one of these days. Uh, I don't know when. Me, father. Uh, but no. Um, I'm Uncle, determined we are going to finish this game up questions? before <laughs> we go to... But before we to go what do you a whole lot chance? further. It's with other games. Looks very old. About as old as this church, I think. There Wahaha. seems to be an engraving on it. Yeah? What does it say? I do not know. It is very tarnished. But Can you clean it? I could try polishing it. Uh, I promise I will be very careful. That would be fantastic. That would be very good of you. This uh, shouldn't take very long. Good. Feel free to look around. I will. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Because, if I remember right... A scroll was a symbol of scholarship. I knew that much. A scholar... But... Made. That rang a bell. A very Spanish bell. Um... See, we should, if I remember right, we can attach the lens that at the end. the end of the scroll like yeah. into a glove. Yes, yeah. so then... For Hey. We look through. And, okay, so we need to adjust. Uh, okay. F flames go there. Flames at the bottom. And... The there we go. The burning at the stake. Yeah. And below him a date in Roman numerals. A and Knight Templar burning at the stake. And hmm. a date. Let me see. M C C C X I V. That's thirteen fourteen. Yeah. That was the that was the year that uh, Jacques de Molay uh, was burned at the stake. A knight there in the company of biblical references, in my guess. Okay, now if I remember right, one of A these. A knight. I thought one of these was uh, had the 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 crest of the Spanish. Um... A stone knight carrying all that armor around must have. Was a stone knight lay at the end of a row of four. Yeah. I wondered if this guy had died in combat. Does 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 it matter? Hey Padre, how's that cup coming? Hey, thanks. It is my pleasure, Monsieur. What was the writing on the chalice? It was not writing. Uh, my mistake. It was a coat of arms. The remarkable thing is that it seems very familiar. Yeah. Really? I think I have seen it on that wool tomb in the far corner. That winged horse really? is quite distinctive. Well. Did you know that the center window conceals an image of a man burning at the stake? The burning man? Yeah. And you? That there was a hidden image? No. But the church has a reputation for being haunted. Many times, people have claimed to have seen a burning man in the window. But when others, they look, there is nothing. Perhaps the light has to be just so for the figure to appear. Yeah, or maybe you need a special lens. Yeah, people with glasses, maybe. Um, Catch you later. Oh, what? So... This, so this one, oh, this wall tomb over in the far corner should be the one for, um... How would my attention have been drawn to it? There was no mistake. George, you're an no idiot. Name on it, but the coat of arms was undeniably the Pegasus of the De Vasconcellos family. I'd found the last yeah! place of Don Carlos. My eye was drawn to the biblical references carved into the edge of the tomb. Hey! Maybe these biblical references mean something. Could be. All right. Uh, a jumble of letters are carved into the side of the... Ba, ba, ba. We need to find chapter and verse. 
Okay, so like... Okay, um... So, I, I don't know what, why, what, why, huh? Okay, so, X, X... This is really kind of weird. Because I don't know what I'm supposed to... I don't know exactly how... How does this thing work? Examine the tomb carefully. Hidden among the writings are... Biblical verse references. Altogether, there are four concealed references. You must highlight all four of them like a word search. Okay. That's that's fine. I understand that. Uh, so, we have Psalms... So what? I have to, like... I... I don't... Ugh, this is frustrating. Because this is, like, the worst possible... I... Hell, but mind. There was the I, worst possible way of doing it. Okay. Chapter and verse in Latin numerals. So, for example, chapter... 8 verse 2 would be displayed Luke, that plus that. Okay. Highlight the full verse reference and letters will stay lit. Otherwise, letters will fade. George will read the verse. Okay. So. Well, we've got this. Is that highlighted? I it can, can you at least have the highlight stay? I mean, I, I am, I am highlighting this. I, it is hi, it is hi, it is lit. It, that was lit. That was perfectly lit. Why did you not? All right, Corinthians. Yeah, this is freaking janky as all get out. Corinthians 14, 5. Not much Thank you. Finally. I more closely, there might be other clues to find. Why did you not... Psalms 32. Okay, so I to a chapter and a verse in the Bible. I don't know if I need to click both or if it's just it takes freaking forever for it to highlight everything. But this is the mo this is this is significantly irritating. This is very, very irritating because it is. It's like janky as fuck. I can't... 
I, I legitimately cannot highlight it anymore. It was fucking yellow as could be. So why did you say, no, nope, we're, we're not going to take it. Sorry. S sorry. I mean, I, I'm obscuring the entire freaking letters and numbers here. Why? Why are... <laughs> Finally. 32 7, John 4 11, Corinthians 1 4 5, and just one more Psalms 22 21. I may not be perfect, but I've got a memory like a steel trap. The chalice had led me to these inscriptions, but it looked like a happy coincidence to me. After all, the Damascus yeah. chalice arms were already on the manuscript. Nope, I was still convinced that the chalice had some significance all of its own. It does. All right. All right, so we finally got that mother. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you had to get it just right. I mean, like just right. Uh, can I? I I I can't go back to France. I I can't go back to Spain. Can I? No, I can't. Um. So. Okay, so supposedly I have to go back to to Spain, but it's not letting me go to Spain. Okay, I just had to go back to Nico's I apartment. I another puzzle. You did? Well, I guess I did. Well, what was it? What's the answer? Coffee is not cutting it. What does that mean? It was the date when Jacques de Molay was burned, wasn't it? Of course. It was the, the year. The answer was hidden in a stained glass window. When I looked through the lens... The picture changed. It became a man surrounded by flames. It seems to me the answers to the Templar puzzles are as cryptic as the clues. Sometimes I wonder if the manuscript isn't an elaborate joke. The Knights Templar weren't the kind of people to play jokes, were they? Probably not, but... I'd better get back to the quest. Yes, back to the quest. Can I go to frickin' Spain now? No! I still can't go to f why the Frick not Hello George Look at the chalice now, Nico <sighs> What happened? It's shiny. The priest at Montfaucon buffed it up for me. That's incredible. Yeah, looks as good as new. No. You found a use for a priest. That's incredible. Ha Ah, 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 ah. Let's take another look. All right. A knight with a crystal ball. No, that the was the lens. The scroll bears a phrase in Latin. Through my teachings, you will be enlightened. So, through the teachings, looking the lens at the on the end of the teachings, the scroll saw that. Okay. There's a guy with a sword and a bull. Between them, a bull's is a head jam specifically. By a tripod. There's a guy working on a. There's a woman looking at her reflection in a mirror, but the reflection. Yes, yes. Okay. Do you want this photograph? Why would she want it back, no, George? You keep it. No. I'd better get back. Maybe, maybe Labano will have something for us. 
Monsieur Labano, can you give us some more information? Hi, Andre. Hello. Where have you been? I just returned from Syria. Yeah. Syria? It's a long story. It was referred to on the manuscript, remember? Yeah. A secret cave built into a high cliff face. In the cave, I discovered a map bearing a phrase in Latin. In the I lies at strange. Like I said, while I was in Syria, I discovered a strange pagan statue. All right, let's like see if we can with get three bearded faces. Horrible. That sounds as if it could be Baphomet. The yeah. Described by the Templars. The poor knights of Christ had an idol that looked like that. Allegedly, the description of the idol came from the evidence extracted by the Inquisition. Yeah. Mind you. Not one statue or idol was ever found on Templar property. Until now, that is. Just last month, a statue of Baphomet was unearthed. Right really? In Paris, where you don't say. An altitude Hermetique de Naval. Ah. The statue is beneath the foundations. It was discovered okay. by some workmen while renovating the building. Can you tell me any more about the statue of Baphomet? All right, so that's where we need to go next. Bearded head. The base of the statue is carved with Templar symbols. One of the workmen noticed a curious stain at the base. He claimed it looked like blood. Blood? That's right. That's right. No big deal. Thanks it was just help, blood. You're welcome. All right. So we need to go there. Uh, yes. Sat du Baphomet. All right. But, this is going to have to wait until next time, because we are all out of time. As always, thank you so much for sticking with me through all that hell. And stay tuned for more From Olav Productions. If you wanna Cheerio! Oh, what the heck. x bling. Cause you know you gotta have that bling when you go to the bars. So we're gonna say pick topic, we're gonna say space for the project. And speaking of other versions of Doc Savage, did you know that he has been featured in both Marvel and DC Comics? 